G'day YouTubers, David here. Uh, in this video, we're going to have a quick look at uh, After Effects and see how we can turn an, ABA, an AVI file into an MP4 file uh, and especially for the use of um, loading up to uh, YouTube. So, okay, turning, turning AVI videos into MP4s. And um, yeah, so let's get started. Okay, so we've opened up After Effects and gonna start with uh, clicking on the composition and new composition. Okay, now with these settings, you can give it a name. Okay, start with, I'll just leave that blank uh, because I'll be giving it a name uh, shortly. And you, from here, you can choose the settings um, that you want to make your video. Okay, now I'm just going the uh, 880 for the uh, or the 180 and the 24 okay because that there gives us a width of 1920 and the 1080 okay and that's that's pretty much about it okay to start with and we just select okay okay so what that does is opens up a screen for our size and we're going to from here import our video okay so we're just going to get a file and um, import file and then we're just going to I've got a, uh, a video on the desktop here and I'll just find that there it is there double click on your video that brings it in okay so from here all we've got to do is drag it down okay into our area and it pops up over there on the screen now we're just going to widen this so it uh, fits in very simple and easy to do okay so that's our screen size that's our video as you can see uh, shows where our video starts and ends okay through here in this blue section here it's a light blue section and it also gives us an idea of how long the movie goes for okay so we've got three minutes here and the video is actually well it's giving us a screen screen um, or video size of about eight minutes there okay so we're just going to drag that down now if you need to change this a uh, simple way is just you can go up to composition and um, you can go into composition settings so if you need to extend the uh, film film length and you go to settings and in this area here this is where we started if you remember um, it starts from zero zero and the duration okay so if you've got a 10 minute film you can just slot in 10 minutes in there okay just by simply adding that and then it just opens up so we can put a 10 minute movie in there okay so this one's only going for three minutes so I'll just drag this down to three minutes simple as that okay and this little red line here shows us whereabouts we are in the video Okay, so from now, we're just going to go back to composition and we're going to click make movie. Okay, and that sets us up for the rendering. Okay, we're going to put, we're going to get onto the output module and we're going to click on that lossless. And what it does is it pops up this little screen here and it tells us a format, what type of format we want. Now, this video is going to be going onto YouTube. So what I want to be doing is I'm just going to come down and I'm going to go H264 uh, and click on that. Okay, that's going to set us up there. It's going to you know give us the um, standard video output settings, and if we wanted to resize it, but we've already got our sizes. If we want to crop it, and if there's any audio on the video, you want to click that so it uh, puts out the audio. Simple as that. Press OK. Now we can give it a name. Okay, we could have done this in the start. So as you can see, comp one. Let's save it to the desktop. And this is an example video, so I'm just gonna put that in there. And as we can see, it's turning it into a H uh, a H.264 MP4. Okay, I'm gonna go save that's where it's going to save it to now before we render it um, to make rendering easier and quicker you're going to need to uh, click the caps lock button down okay and then you click render 
and that's it it starts up and um, we'll start rendering the movie from an AVI file to an MP4 file perfect for YouTube and um, web videos okay and so that's about it as you can see it gives us an idea of how long it's going to take uh, it'll go through in a few minutes once it's done it'll just pop up and tell us it's finished and um, from there yeah you can close it down and um, your video will be wherever you saved it onto the desktop for this one okay and then you'll be able just to uh, yeah take a video and upload it to uh, YouTube or to you to your web or wherever you want to take it to okay so I hope that helps you out guys on um, just adding a quick AVI file to um, After Effects and turning it into an MP4 alright so see you in the next video guys